Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, I'm going to give a little intro here real quick. Go over what I've done. And then we'll get right on to the rest of the assembly as far as I know. I pulled this pin and I pulled all these out. And I tried to straighten these up as best I could. And you can see this one here is still a little crooked. I mean, you can see the gap right there. It, this one still doesn't turn very well. And one of them over here is not turning too well. I can't remember which one. I think it's this, this, I think it's this one. And N, NZG told me, wait, <laughs> because they don't have anybody there to deal with it. So I don't know how long it's going to take to even get another A-arm. So as you can see, I reeved it. As per the book, you can see both of the lines going up into the middle here. Well, not in case you can't, but yeah. Uh, one other trick is these little guys here. I stuck some uh, oil, some vegetable oil, olive oil. I don't know what it is in there. I put a little bit on my finger and stuck it on this tip right there. And these things just slide right in. Uh, I wish I did that in the beginning. Uh, the ladders, which we're going to do today, these things obviously don't... You can see that's way too big. That's what goes there. And all, all of these flop. Uh, all of these... Down under here, I I drilled out. The, the, the things would hardly go in them. And I did the same thing over here. All of these I ran a little drill through. So I could get this stuff up inside there a little bit better. I think that, yeah, there's some that go up here. I had to drill all these. So I should be able to get get these things. They fit a little better once you drill them. Uh, one of these, the side ladder wouldn't stay on. I, I don't remember which one it is now, but I, I put a little glue on it. It's holding it pretty good. This one we get to put together. Uh, any of these that I put in here now, if they don't stick, I guess I'm just going to glue them in real quick. Uh, I'll probably just take them out later and, and glue them in. All right, that should be a pretty fair place to put it. See if I can get that boom in there. Uh, our first one, let me get to the right page. Is this guy, and it goes over this, this pin here that we don't have in yet. But as you can see, it doesn't stay. So it's automatically gonna, gonna get a little bit of glue. So we'll just move along. A lot of these do go in pretty good and they'll stay and I'm fine with them. If you noticed, yeah, my cab sags just a little bit, unfortunately. Which side did I go on now? Where are we going? It says that goes on there, but it doesn't look like it's going to go very well. See, is there a little thing to slip in? Nope. No tab there, but that ain't gonna hold it either. It says it goes right here. 
We'll see if there's another one, maybe. That looks like the one. And it doesn't look like it's going to sit very well. And it doesn't go to the bottom like it shows. So we'll just move along. Uh, I think it's this one. Yep. This one's next. Exactly what I was talking about right there. They uh, they don't want to stay in very well. Yeah, okay. I'll just glue that in later, so no problem. stay in too good. This one's going to need to be glued too. It's not staying either is this one. I'll move along. My uh, little mirror goes here. It won't stay either. So uh, all I can think to do is move on. Put it as much as I can here. Let's see. Holes I did drill out, so they they kind of hold in there pretty good. And watch where these go; they got a little indentation in them, and there is an indentation down here that they got to fit in. Hard to see that stuff in here. Yeah, that one's not gonna. That one's not gonna. 
going to stay in for me either. See, that one's already on. Oh, I got a couple here. Forgot about these. They go on the boom. Yeah, I had to drill these out too. A little bit. They, they, they wouldn't even go in. At least now they're going into the bottom. That. Yeah, let me make sure which way they go. someplace oh dang Put that one in until I pull that out. things here are a real bummer because they don't yeah I'm pretty sure about all of these I'm gonna have to put a little something on them Unfortunately, they, they just don't fit that big, big hole.
part of the assembly. I'm going to show it to you real quick. And uh, slap that boom on. I know everybody's waiting to see that. These look terrible here like this. I didn't even want to do this, but I thought I'd at least show you. I, I don't I don't know how all the rest are, but or at least the rest of the models. Everybody doesn't seem to be having this problem. Some of the holes seem to be sized okay, and some of them just not at all. here there's a little a little slot under this uh, ramp that gets there these things go in And these I'll just have I'll have to glue them in. A lot of this stuff just doesn't won't stay in. It is kind of a bummer. Alright, I'm gonna take a minute here and I'm gonna put these counterweights in. Calls for 12 of them here, roughly. in the back for now. But they did give uh they did, did give you enough of them. It's a pretty pretty good stack right here. They'll stay if you can manage not to hit them like I do. the big part. gonna be a tough part. I don't have help to lift this boom up and I'm gonna try and stick it on my shoulder and uh, see if I can't get this thing hooked up for you. Otherwise I'm gonna have to get a hand in here, another hand to lift it up. 
hold it like with the pendants in. I'm going to try it. And you can get a little laugh, maybe. This will probably be a little bit of a struggle. <laughs> but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give it a try. Oh, boy. go flying. I expected it. All right, I'm going to probably take up a lot of the room here. Give me a minute and uh, I'll probably have this thing done. this would probably be easier than uh, trying to find somebody to come and do this. I did have a little help doing the reaving for my kid. Uh, the diagram, I don't know if it's just my diagram, but it just is not very clear and it's hard to follow. And I tried reaving it a couple of times and struggled with it. See if it'll hold itself up. I may have to pull the boom down a little bit because it's uh that boom is heavy. And yeah, it's it's most likely gonna have to come down. Oh I probably should have done that. But it's holding. I would say it's struggling a little bit, but <laughs> it's holding. All right, y'all. Let me pull this camera up here real quick. I'll get a couple of closer looks at it. I'll do a review in a while. I gotta put the nuts on them little things I put in. I just thought I'd get it real quick here for you. And at least you can see it pretty much done. I'm gonna put the rest of the counterweights on it because it's taken a toll. I'll probably lift the boom a little bit as well. And uh, stay tuned for a review. The thing is way up there. That is a 10-foot ceiling. It's a foot and a half maybe below. So, yeah, it's pretty tall. They gave you plenty of uh, main boom, and I like that. It's going gonna, gonna to look good next to that 1600. It'll stick up inside there. All right, y'all. There it is. The only other thing is the uh, hook breathing and... Uh, like I said, I'll probably I, I may do that on on a live video for y'all. All right, guys.
have a great day next time you see it all these will be uh standing up kind of straight have a great day thanks for watching y'all and i'm enjoying your comments <laughs> just keep them keep them coming